Hello my friends, today I want to go ahead and show you how to restring a weed eater. So this is a maybe a different model than some that you may have. This is a brand new weed eater as of the time of this recording. It even still has a thing right here. Quick start guide, Echo. It's a really nice weed eater. Um, it's so nice. I might not even ever use it. I might just keep it on my bed and just, I'm joking. Okay, I want to go ahead and do a video before I get it all dirty and filthy. So I want to go ahead, so <clears throat> I want to take the string off of it and then put it back on and show you. Okay, so here's this. It, basically what you have here is you have these two things right here and you basically have to push this in and this in and it pops up. Okay, but let's go ahead and take this off and I wanna go ahead and show you how to do this. Okay, so I wanna unwind all this. Um, if it was a real world situation, you would have probably <clears throat> have already used it up. So this is what it looks like. <clears throat> now we have arrows to make see which way it goes. Then we have a thing that goes right through here. So the weed ear is gonna go through this bar right here. And you might be like, well, how, how much string do I have? That, I'm glad you brought that up. Okay, so I'm six foot. So if I go like this right here, and I put one hand here by my chest and one hand out, that's about three feet. So three, whoa, six. Now we have about six feet. And then three more feet, three, six, nine. And that's about three feet. So that should be about 12 feet right there. So we go ahead and we take this thing right here and we just slide it through so it's about halfway. Okay, so basically when we end up, we want it to be pretty much matching. Now you don't have to be 100% precise. Um, <clears throat> I want to hurry and let you not bore you all sit here and tell you my life story while I do it. But I, I, I want to be quick, but I also want to be thorough. So, all right. <clears throat> so you can do it a couple different ways. You can try to wind it all at the same time if you want to. You can see this groove right here. It just kind of naturally goes in that groove. So I can just kind of start that right there. And then I can wind this one at the same time. Or if you don't feel comfortable, you can just wind one at a time. You might just want to try to wind both if you can because it may be faster. But if not, you might have to. Um, I, <clears throat> we haven't really come to the hardest part probably yet. Um, by the way, everyone, if you're watching this, um, please subscribe, turn on notifications, leave a comment. If you don't know what to say, just say, hi, how are you? And I actually like to read people's comments. Um, and I might respond back to you. I might give it a heart, because I heart you, how your comment, you're special. I like to um, I like it to read people's comments. Some people have some funny comments too. Like some of the, I have over two thousand four hundred I think videos and live streams up, and some people are so funny with the, what they like come up with. It's hilarious. So if you have a funny comment, cool. If you don't know what to say, just say hi if you want. Okay. All right. So this is coming down to the hard part. So I need to put. See, I did it with the arrows, and I need to put this on here. All right. This part right here is where the bar goes, but I need to have the string go through each hole. So I would say this is probably the hardest section coming right here. And um, you might even want to practice this if you have a new weed eater a couple times before you're out in the sun and hot and sweaty. I just lost my weed eater. I hope my wife doesn't find out about that. Will my wife ever find out about that? She'll never know. Okay. I won't tell her. Okay. All right. She is my wife, just so you all know. All right. Okay. Here we go. Um, let's go ahead and try to stick it on. Hold it down. I need to put this on. So this thing, um, this will spin. Okay. So let's go ahead and I need the wire. I need this one wire to come through here and the other wire to come through there. This is probably one of the hardest parts of this entire process. Can they see it clearly? Because so. you kind of, you might even mess up a couple times. You might have to try it again. And then I need to stick this through there. Um, here we go. So that looks pretty good. This needs to be pulled off and that looks good. And 
we are, I think we're just about got it. So I have to hold this here. I might do an affiliate link for like weed eater string or something. Um, the links, maybe, maybe put the type of weed eater string trimmer I have. Um, all right, so we got this. That looks good, it's looking good. And then we take this, and this may be different than some weed eaters, just how this string puts together, different models may be different. So we got two things here, and then two things here, these little pokey things. And so two of them go in here, and two will go on the other side. So that kind of gives you a, like a point of reference, like, okay, so I need to stick that part over there, yep. And then this right here goes in this, there's like a hole. You can kind of line it up. Okay. And you should be able to kind of stick it on like so. And it should kind of latch so it shouldn't just pop up easily. So see this side, it looks like it latched. And then over here, this side did not latch yet. So if I was started weeding without that, that could be a problem. So then I go ahead and latch it all the way. So we, it looks like we're doing pretty good. Now, <clears throat> I have this string too long right now. So I could do a couple different things. I could kind of pull it um, like so, and I could just trim it right now if I wanted to. Like I could bring it to here. I, or actually, I could just trim it right there. And I could bring this one and just go ahead and cut it. Or I could turn it on and it might eventually just kind of end up being cut. But if you have like a knife or a pair of scissors, you might just want, kind of want to get it right to about there and cut it right where this little thing is right here, which you're supposed to cut it anyways. And it might just make your process like a little bit easier. Um, thank you all so much for watching. Please subscribe, turn on notifications. Let me know what you think. I love it that I got a nice weed eater. I'm super happy about, about it. Um, let me, tell me something in the comments. I like to read comments. Love y'all. Bye.